okay something else has happened that i haven't told kurt about these construction workers came and said the the dump point's over there mate and what was it changed i can feel the sun rising on my bed So we're starting our journey now. We're starting, we've got our new home. We're in Surrey Hills and off we go. Sand dunes are a great place to practice with the drone. I tried it inside and I immediately crashed it into my reed diffuser. So I do need a bit of practice. Okay. I have no idea what that's filming. <laughs> I think it's upside down. So, um, yeah, here we are. First, um, first stop of the trip. Mission and a half. The, uh, the maneuvering getting into this was just diabolical. Ready? Oh, look, it's been a few years. It's all real. It's all real. Wait, is this yours as well? No, I think that's yours. That's fine. We look at the scarf section after the toy section, which Thank is you. where we're going right now. <laughs> That's, that's not the Barbie aisle. So, um, we just went to pick up some essentials. Somehow, this, um, became a part of that because we've got a DVD player. It's gonna be either that or fishing shows. <laughs> so we're, um, just in the car park at Coles and Target. And we're just gonna wear things and um yeah it's quite tempting we could just stay in this car park for tonight everything we need everything we need <laughs> you were born for this <laughs> basically level with Broken Hill, so now we just go west. Fuck. Did we... Okay, so we've just arrived in Dubbo. We're parked on the side of the road by, um, next to a kindergarten and across the, <laughs> the road from the field. But we're just setting up camp, so Kurt's having a limb sip. Oh yeah. And I'm gonna have a wine. Amazon. Yeah, yeah, that's good. So this is our um, dinner for the night because we had red rooster for lunch. So we're going a bit like bird, bird picking, bird theme, bird thing. Day two. We're on our way to uh, Koba. All those wildflowers. It's like the uh, Tom Petty song. And that is all. If I can't really know you, I'd rather walk home. If I can't really... Here's the cannoli fields. Where they grow the cannolis. All the cannolis come from there. Alright, so we are um the side of the road and we just decided to um pull off here because we think we're gonna we think this is a good place to film some shit. Dollar now wish there was a way that I could
And let's see how this goes. Whoa, hello. So we're now in uh, Koba. Koba. This is Koba. It's actually uh, really freezing still. It looks warm. And uh, we're gonna go to my Gumna. Mocking that payphone in Koba. <laughs> we are in the uh, middle of nowhere. And you have to use the payphone. Like. <laughs> I'm about to use a pay payphone for the first time in about 10 years. <laughs> you have $2 ten. I have changed too. Oh, sweet. Because we need change. I think so. I really don't know how much it costs to use a payphone. Do you have your change ready? I think yeah. you know if you're running out Hi there, um, this is Kurt. I'm, I've got a booking tonight and I just need to add my payment details because we'll be arriving after hours. No worries. I, yeah, you, I think you tried to call me back, but we've been out of service. Department of Trace. Please? We just finished filming at this amazing uh, desert road, which is just perfect for what we wanted. Feet down this low. My friend, only the best things in life can happen when you let go. All right, so this is our tour. Bathroom. Mirror. Kurtster at his working desk. We've got our fridge and the bed up here. And we from this vantage point. We can really get the whole picture. I really loved you, 3rd of June, the words keep tumbling now. This is the Broken Hill Tourist Park. I really loved you and you're glad I didn't check in now. Day three. Really Wednesday the 26th of August. We are at the cruising. No, we're at the um Broken Hill Broken Tourist, Tourist Park. Park. <laughs> cruising. <laughs> the cruising hotel. The cruising hotel. The cruising hotel. And I'm just filled up the little plugged in to power now. Filled up the water, emptied the toilet, which is fun. And um, we'll be getting in the way soon. So what what was the um what was the dramas, Kurt? Tell me what the errors were. Oh my god. Okay. Are we um we're gonna rent? I bought this hard drive specifically for this project so that we would have something because I'm using a MacBook Air. See, so this doesn't have room. 
for anything, let alone four days of footage. So I bought this hard drive and I went into JB Hi-Fi and I had another hard drive in my hands. And I asked the guy like, oh, I have a Mac. And the guy was like, oh, no, 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 don't get that one because you're going to have to reformat that before you can even use it. You need this one. So I bought this one, it was over $100 and I plug it in. First, I have to download all of this fucking um, software for it. This is after, dri I mean, okay, I didn't drive to be fair, but we had driven a long, t a long way. It was late. Like, okay, I'll download, the the, download the software. So I download the software, it takes its sweet time. Then I go to drag it on and it's got like the no symbol. And so I have to reformat it, but it doesn't have any instructions. So then I have to look up online how to reformat it. And I figure it out or someone tells me how to do it and I go to do it. And then it's like, can't reformat. And it's like brand new out of the box. So instead I'm using this little thumb drive that my work gave me to put my voice profile on, which I've never did, so it was still in the pack. That worked. And at the same time we're using these brand new fucking things that don't have a USB, so we're like pooling all of our resources just to plug things in. And I've been going all morning. Okay, something else has happened that I haven't told Kurt about. Um... So out there is um, a drainage uh, pipe where the taps are, and um, I was emptying the emptying the toilet cassette. Well, I, I went to empty it, and um, I thought that out there was the uh, the dump. Uh, the toilet disposal drain and I was just about to empty it into that and then one of these construction workers came and said hey can't empty that in there the the dump points over there mate and what was it I don't know I think it's for grey water Is like like shower yeah I think you can hook up your your uh, pipe into that but I looked over across at the, p the people next to us and I saw that they'd hooked up their pipe into that drain I thought yeah that must be from the toilet but no that is not a sewage <laughs> sewage pipe <laughs> I just picture us emptying like uh, into that little pipe and that's really not what that's for just just three days of shit <laughs> right into that <laughs> so yeah I'm glad uh, no it's, one. It's funny because we joked about that happening before he did it. This is the Outback. Oh my God. You know what? I think I want this. Not necessarily now, but on the way back, once we know that we don't want to shoot it anywhere else. Yeah. Fresh scones. 
kind of want to go oh there. Oh my goodness. The street that I was planning on shooting on. Museum. Oh, Mad Max 2. Mad Max 2, <laughs> Mad Max Museum. 2 Museum. Wow. Okay, so we are filming right next to the Mad Max Museum. We're going to film a scene of me walking on the desert. And right now I'm going to roll in the dirt to get dirty. Make it realistic. Kurt's filmed on the fuel gauge being down. Okay, so I guess I'm just gonna do this. I'm gonna roll, lie down in the desert and roll around in the dirt just to get dirty. <sighs> okay. Mm -hmm. Just to make it realistic. This is kind of like. <laughs> oh, I'm being filmed. <laughs> mm. So we're at the Silverton Hotel. Oh, yes. Have the beer. Um, I have a story for you. Yes. So um, one of the staff was just in here, and I, I mentioned that those things down there were like really interesting. Um, and she said that one of the owners caught them all and they've all come from in here inside the hotel in and around the hotel oh. i almost wish we caught her on camera <laughs> <laughs> all right so um we're off into the, the grave scene as we call it got some gray kind of some gray beard going on um, we're gonna. Oh, this is good. This soft stuff. Nice and soft. But um. Perfect. Yeah. So here's me, just um, in my underwear. Not that I should be putting this on. That's gonna get flagged. Yep. <laughs> Digging in the grave. Kenya. Good morning. Kurt, tell me, what has been your favorite, favorite location so far? 
to shoot or to stay? Hey, whatever, man. Yeah. Yeah, I mean to. Including a little bit where we parked the camp to do that, but we leave it. That road mm. there and the dust tornado. Mm hmm. What about Dabo, though? <laughs> that was. <laughs> yeah. I know you're half joking, but I know you're also half not, because our first night there was like quaint and mm. cool and cute. And, yeah. Yeah. Mm. I agree. Dabo, Dabo was great. Yeah, Dabo was its own, um, had its own, yeah, charm. Last night, we just turned up to this caravan park without any, um, notice. Uh, 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 you need to calm down. You're being too loud. loud. Or reception. Or followed the street signs. Followed street signs. We need to figure out how to pay. We're back in um, Koba, way home, and uh, we've got another eight and a half hours drive. Thank you, but that's not all that comes.